Good morning, everyone. This is Lisa from Happy to Hook Creations. And today is the 5th of December. I'm looking at my last month of my Star Wars, no, Star Trek calendar. <sighs> and it's the one of the Enterprise. And it says, The Squire of Gothos. Anyway, I'm just wanted to know, just wanted you to know that, just in case you, you know. That's what I'm staring at right now. And then my set of, um, my set of cowl, no, calendar that I got. She's wearing a cowl. Uh, I need to switch that to December because I believe the December one is uh, Crystal from Bag o Day. So anyway, how's everyone doing this morning? Today is, again, December 5th. It is Tuesday. It is already December 5th, you guys. I have so much to do. Oh my gosh. So anyway, let, let's, this is a coffee chat and some, some crochet. Um, this just loveys. I have loveys to show you that I've worked on because I'm listing them in the shop today. Um, so hi to all my subscribers. Thank you guys so much for stopping by. I appreciate your support as always. Um, you know, just keep liking and subscribing because I appreciate you for that. <clears throat> Excuse me. Um, if you are here for the first time, my name is Lisa. This is Happy to Hook Creations. This um, actually that was um, that was a name that my husband thought of when, and no joke, the Happy Hooker was taken. <laughs> That's the one we wanted to be. So I would have been the Happy Hooker. Um, I ended up being Happy to Hook. He just said, "Let's just reverse it and see if it's there." Um, and yeah, we added creations a little bit later, but that's that. Um, uh, so I am on several social media platforms. So not only can you find me on YouTube, I'm also on Instagram. I'm on TikTok, Pinterest, and also Facebook. Now, Facebook, I have two pages. One page is attached to my Etsy shop. Um, and then I have another page that is a private page. You have to answer one question to join, but it's such a wonderful group of people. We lift each other up, show each other items that we are making, things that we're working on. Um, maybe if someone needs a discontinued yarn, they ask about that. We put up uh, free patterns for you and um, yarn sales. So definitely go and join if that's something you're interested in because we would love to have you. So all of this will be in the description box below, all my links. Um, I've got my um, email address there. If anybody ever has a question that they want to ask me, my email address is there. Feel free. I might not know the answer, but you can definitely email me. All right. <coughs> Excuse me. I, I was watching the Canadian Crotcheter um, video yesterday. I'm trying to play catch up because it's, you know, being on vacation, I didn't have time. And so I'm behind a little bit. And, um, Debbie and I go way back. <laughs> oh, I just love me some Debbie. She is wonderful. If you do not know who she is, you definitely need to check her out. Her link will be in the description box below. But uh, years ago, we did um, a yarn swap, and this is what she gave me. So, oh, there's something on there. There we go. She gave me this cup, among other wonderful things. And um, I just love this cup because I always think of you, Debbie. Um, she, the last one I made, I'm, I'm trying to catch up. And so now I got to go to Seta's, um, website because Seta has a cardigan cowl or no, a cardigan, a granny cow. I, I'm just really onto this cowl for some reason. It is a granny cardigan and she made hers out of the, I think mandala gnome. Oh my gosh. It's so pretty. So many beautiful colors. Gnome is one of my favorites. So definitely check her out. Like I said, her link will be in the description box below. Setas is always there too. So yeah, thanks again, Debbie. Still got the mug, girl. Um, anyway, <laughs> I wanted to get on here because I made some lovies that I need to get listed in my shop because I've got a few people that are already interested. Um, I've got, oh, I, oh my gosh, you guys. <laughs> So, uh, I ordered some stuffed animals. I'm not going to show you those. I'm just going to show you them 
um, once I have the lovey made. So I only have like six, but I definitely wanted to get to show you because like I said, I'm not sure um, if someone's going to reach out to me. They were asking me and I said, mm, let me list it on the shop and then, you know, we'll see how it goes because I've got another set coming, but it's already delayed. I've already gotten an email address because everyone's looking for this particular one. So Kohl's has what's called Kohl's Cares for Kids, I think. And a lot of times they'll have these cute little stuffed animals, um, uh, characters. I can't even say animals because um, they're just characters, Sesame Street characters. Um, the Grinch, they've had Christmas characters, just, you know, whatever you can, can find when they have them there. And they usually have them for a really good price, five to seven, no, five to nine dollars. Um, depending on what it is. Well, when I ordered these, I, I get so excited, you guys. I don't really look at the size of the item. You know where I'm going with this. So, I get this in the mail because I knew it was going to show up the day after vacation. Um, wow. So, I'm used to... Lovey's, my lovey characters being about, I don't know, maybe seven, maybe seven inches tall. That, that would be like the norm. Um, it's a good size, you know, it works. This one's about 14, um, <clears throat> maybe even 15, but he's so cute. Um, and I have another one that I ordered actually two more. So, um, here is Cookie Monster. <laughs> um, and he, oh, look, he matches my outfit. I should take him to work with me today. So, guys, he's huge. Um, and I was just going to give these away as gifts. And then Jack said, make a lovey and then decide what you want. So, I was like, okay. So, they had, the characters that they had at Michael's, um, I don't know if you have to go online or what, but I got this one. I got Big Bird and I got, they had one Elmo. They're all this size. And this is, let me, hold on, let me just show you. Because like I said, they're normally, I put this on 14. They're normally about seven inches, right? It's like double what I'm used to. It's big. It's, yeah, it's 14 inches, guys. So... I'm already starting on one for Big Bird. Oh my gosh, it's looking adorable. Let me show you. So this is my first lovey um, that I'm going to list in my shop. He is soft and squishy, you guys. Some little kid is going to absolutely love this guy. I searched and searched and searched my stash. And I found something that I think would look really cute. So you guys let me know what you if you agree. All right. Oh, my goodness. Such a big guy. <laughs> okay, you ready? Here's his lovey. I think that matches really nicely with his color. He's such a beautiful shade of blue. And this is, um. oh, I left it in the kitchen. Um, loops and threads. This is, I've had this for years. I don't even know if they still make this yarn. Um, if they do, that's great. But... <clears throat> So this is going to be my first, my first lovey that I'm going to list in my shop. They're all going in um, today. So hopefully by the time you read this, or you read this, you see this video, um, it will have been, they will have been listed already. Today I'm drinking caramel macchiato coffee with sugar-free Italian cream. Delicious. So this little guy, okay, he's not little, but this guy's my first lovey that I'm going to be listing. <laughs> I think he's absolutely adorable. You sit right there, Cookie Monster. I can't wait to get um, Big Bird. Man, I don't know what's going on with my eye. <clears throat> okay, so then I had um, I had ordered these. Um, I was watching Rose from Rose Likes Crochet. You know, her and I talk. We talk a lot, okay? <laughs> I'm not gonna lie to you. If I have a question, I always go to Rose. Um, and, you know, we always compare where we, like where we're buying stuff. And she has stores where she's located. We're both in Illinois, but she has more stores than I do 
Um, but I travel. So when she tells me that she finds, you know, that she finds cute little characters for lovies, then when I'm out of town, I try to find that store. Well, this one just happened to be, she found these, I believe, at a Walgreens. Um, so I checked my Walgreens, both of them, uh, they didn't have any. So then I just went to um, the Thai store online because it's free. they offer free shipping. And I ordered these during Black Friday. So um, I think I got like $5 off. But anyway, they are super, super cute. Um, let's see. The first guy, his name is Nolan. And he is a little gnome. And don't you just love his hat? Aren't they cute? Oh, So this is the normal size for me. This is a good size for a lovey. Nice you know, um, not too thin and not too thick for the neck. I always, um, I, cause since my hair is really thick, it hasn't been lately because I've been using this, um, flat iron, uh, br uh, not flat iron. Um, oh gosh, a cut or a brush that straightens as you brush it. I have to use that thing every day, guys. I just don't know if it's worth it. It's so much work. And my hair is just getting longer. So we'll work on that later. I, but anyway, um, <laughs> anyway, so this guy, this is the size that I normally like to get. And um, he is just, I mean, they came in a set. They came in a set of four, right? Um, and then I liked it so much, I ordered another set. It should be here today. Um, today or tomorrow, I think. Today's the fifth. Yeah, it should actually be here today um, because they were just so adorable. Now, I do have a favorite. I will show you that one in a minute. But this is Nolan. Um, and I think these are the most, <laughs> these are just the cutest things ever. So let me show you the lovey that I put on him, on Mr. No Nolan. And oops, I got his hand stuck in the whole thing here. And okay, let me get his little beard situated. So this is Nolan's. And I think it turned out really nicely with his hat. So this is him. Ta-da. Oh my gosh, he's so cute. I wish the lighting was better. It is really, really overcast. It, um, what time is it? I don't know. It's 728 right now. And it looks like it's, you know, four o'clock in the afternoon about to get dark because it's going to be rainy and cold today. Ugh. So <clears throat> that was Nolan. And I get, you know, I've got all my lights on in here and it's just not working very well. And this gnome, his name is Newman. So Nolan, he had a polka dot hat and Newman has a striped hat and he's wearing a Santa outfit. I think he's adorable. I just love him. Isn't he cute? All right. So let me show you his lovey. Whoops. Trying to not, to not tear off the... All right, and this is no uh, Newman. So this is Newman. So yarn is a lot, it's like a lot um, thinner. This is the yarn from Hobie. So look at that, isn't that cute? So, so far these are the two. And this is Nolan and this is Newman. There they are. All right, now. This little guy's name is, I don't know if I can find him on here, if I can open it up. <laughs> this is Garland. This is Garland, and he's a snowman. And he's wearing, see, so he's got, his little outfit has lights, lights on them, strings of lights. Oh my gosh, he's so adorable. So, if you can see, I, his little eyes are so cute. There are these really pretty different colors like he's wearing. Um, I just, I didn't want to do anything freaky or to take away from his eyes or his hat with his cute little. So I made him a chunky lovey. I hope I can get his hand out of there. All right, there we go. So I made him a chunky lovey. And what is the Garland? So this is Garland. <laughs> Isn't he cute? Oh my goodness, he is so cute. So, so far, we've got Newman, oh wait a minute, Newman, Garland, and Nolan. 
Yay! Aren't they great? And I got to use up a lot of my Christmas yarn or Christmas color yarn. That is, um, this is all leftover yarn from when I did a collaboration with Hobie. So I was really excited about that. Okay, this little guy is one of my favorites. I'm not going to lie to you. His name is Crumble, okay? <laughs> He's a gingerbread. Oh my gosh. He, I just love him. I love him so much. He Look at his little feet. Oh my gosh. And his eyes are just so big and full of life and happy. So, <laughs> uh oh, I took an ink pen with me. I don't think I want an ink pen. Let me show you his lovey or, or him with his lovey. Oh my gosh, I think it looks so cute. So this was um, Mistletoe by Red Heart that I used. And doesn't he look adorable? Ugh, he just looks so cute. Man, I like him. This one is definitely one of my favorites. All right, I got one more. Okay, he's another favorite. <laughs> They're all favorite. They're all just so stinking cute. This is Sleigh Bell. Let me take another sip of this beautiful, wonderful, delicious coffee. Okay, this is Sleigh Bell. And he's wearing a beanie that can come off. It's a removable beanie. I like him with his beanie on. And there are his beautiful eyes. Isn't he just so cute and adorable? Look, there's the back. So let me show you. Let me show you his. Is this right? Yeah. Let me show you his lovey. He is just so, so cute. They're all just adorable. And this is Red Heart. I don't remember the color, but um, it's their own, the Red Heart Ombre yarn. So there is Sleigh Bell. Ta-da. He looks really cute. Doesn't he look so cute? Oh my gosh, I love him. Okay, so that's, those are, what, what did I say? These are six, I believe. So we've got Sleigh Bell. Um, this, I believe, is, is this Newman? I've already gotten it messed up. Yes, it is. So Newman and Sleigh Bell. And then we've got... Nolan and Garland. And then we have Crumble. Let's get ready to crumble. I had to do it. I'm sorry. I had to. <laughs> uh, anyway, guys, that's all I have for now. These will be listed in my shop. And as I stated, probably by the time this video gets released today, um, before I go, if December 5th happens to be your birthday, happy birthday to you. If it is your anniversary, happy anniversary to you both. I hope you guys have a safe and happy day surrounded by people that you love and whom love you back. Um, let's see. Was there anything else? Okay. I guess that's it. I mean, ugh, if I have to let you go, I guess I'll do that. Um, but fear not, I will be back. <laughs> Um, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you're having a wonderful start to your day and um, I will see you when I see you. Happy hooking everyone. <laughs> Bye for now.